Hello everybody, today we're going to talk about how to store your hydrogen water. See, this is one of the problems with hydrogen water, is that the hydrogen leaves the water. And it makes it actually kind of frustrating because if you want to take it with you to the gym, or if you want to just take it with you to work because you're not by your machine all day long, the hydrogen really doesn't last that long in the water. Now, with the Lourdes, they claim that the hydrogen stays in the water for something like 12 hours at 80 or 90 percent. But I've been doing some testing with with you know the the blue drops here I think I've talked about them before but they're Japanese blue drops that are really accurate in testing for hydrogen and it doesn't hold it for 12 hours and I actually found out how and why they claim that number what they were doing is when when the hydrogen water is exposed to the air that actually causes the hydrogen to leave and also movement causes the hydrogen to leave and also it just depends on a lot of different factors like the temperature of the water and whatnot so when they came up with that 12 hour number was because they had taken some hydrogen water from the Lourdes machine then they put it in a little container where they sucked the air out of the container then they set it down the water was at 68 degrees and they set it down it didn't move at all and 12 hours later it still had 80 percent to 90 percent roughly of the hydrogen in it but that's not what i would call a real world scenario realistically it would probably stay in the water depending on many factors for about an hour or two or so and so that just wasn't working for me i really needed to be able to take the water with me and i couldn't figure out any way to do it i was putting it in stainless steel containers it wasn't working until i finally found this really cool Japanese pouch that is it's there's only one company in the entire world apparently that makes these special pouches for hydrogen water it has many different layers of specific materials that are able to hold the hydrogen in it also sucks the air out of the container it's a it has a patent on it you squeeze the air out of it and then it, every time you pour it into your mouth no air ever gets into the container then the inner layer also of the pouch is some type of non-toxic material and then it has a, a some type of it's a patented nozzle also as you can see even this part connects to the actual pouch and then there's something actually inside the pouch now I have a cover on it because it protects it it's kind of like a space bag it would look more like this thing this is what they look kind of like new and it's just a big it's a special pouch and what you do is you just open it up and you pour water in it and you screw the top on it's got a nice um, good seal on it like a gasket then you have to take this little top off and then you squeeze it you fill it up to about here you can fill it up all the way the manufacturer says to fill it up about 80 percent I fill mine up a little more but then you squeeze the, the air out of it and once water comes up a little bit that's when you stop and then you can see this has a little gasket on it and then I just put that on and you can take this water with you all day long now the manufacturer claims that you can put this sideways which is better apparently because of the pressure in your refrigerator and the 90 to 100 percent of the hydrogen will stay in the water for two weeks now that's pretty crazy but in real world scenarios again I did my own testing so I filled this thing up I took it with me all day long the temperature was rather warm there was a lot of movement I ran errands I went to the gym I you know grocery shopping for 24 hours when I tested it there was about 80 to 90 percent of the hydrogen still left after 24 hours but that's with movement that's with you know hot temperatures in the car it was there was a lot of factors so actually it was pretty impressive so basically you can fill this up and take it with you all day long it holds about a liter and a half of water and it's been for me it's been an absolute lifesaver I can't even live without it but this outer cover has helped me a lot because this thing can get punctured and it's not super fragile but you know eventually it, it, it can get damaged so I just thought I'd share that with people because a lot of people are telling me how can I take the hydrogen water with me you know to different places and this thing has been an absolute lifesaver um, you can't really <laughs> you can't find it anywhere the only place that I was able to find it was at holyhydrogen.com they don't sell it on the website at this time but if you want to specifically request one you have to, I had to write them at info at holyhydrogen.com and then you can request it from them 
And that's the only way I was able to get my hands on one. But from what I understand, eventually they'll have them on their website. So again, I just wanted to share this with you guys. I hope you found it helpful and I'll see you next time.